Using the U-Box trailer's tongue jack, lower the trailer's coupler until it completely covers and encloses your tow vehicle's hitch ball and the trailer's tongue is being supported by the hitch ball. Turn the hand wheel clockwise to tighten the ball clamp up against the hitch ball. When the hand wheel becomes tight, push rearward on the trailer to ensure that the hitch ball is properly seated inside the coupler. Recheck that the hand wheel is tight. Once the coupler has been properly connected to the hitch ball, pull the retaining pin on the tongue jack and rotate it into its horizontal traveling position. Next, cross the trailer's right safety chain underneath the tongue and connect it to the left side of your tow vehicle's permanent hitch, frame, or bumper brackets. Allow enough slack in the chain for your vehicle to turn safely, but short enough to keep the chain from dragging on the ground. Control the slack by hooking the chain back into itself with the S-hooks, securing the S-hooks with the rubber retainer. Repeat these steps to connect the left safety chain to the right side of your tow vehicle's permanent hitch, frame, or bumper brackets. Next, insert the trailer's four-way flat plug into your tow vehicle's lighting connection system. As with the safety chains, leave enough slack in the lighting wiring for your vehicle to turn safely, but short enough to keep from dragging on the ground. If your tow vehicle does not have a four-way flat connection, a U-Haul representative will be happy to assist you with finding the proper solutions and products available for your vehicle. Also, be sure to test that the trailer's turn signals and brake lights are in proper working order before driving away. When you are ready to disconnect, park the U-Box trailer on level ground in a straight line with your tow vehicle in park, the motor turned off, and the parking brake set. Remove the four wheel chocks from their designated holder located at the front of the U-Box container. Place the wheel chocks under the front and rear of the trailer's tires. Next, disconnect the safety chains and lighting wiring from your tow vehicle. Return them to the respective storage locations on the trailer's tongue to prevent them from getting tangled or damaged and from becoming a potential tripping hazard. Loosen the hand wheel on the coupler by pressing down on the latch and rotating the hand wheel counterclockwise. Once loosened, pull the retaining pin on the tongue jack, rotate the jack down to its vertical position, and release the pin making sure that it's engaged to secure the jack vertically. Turn the tongue jack handle to raise the coupler off the hitch ball. Once the coupler is clear of the hitch ball, you can pull your tow vehicle forward and away from the trailer. To stabilize the U-Box trailer, rotate the tongue jack handle to raise or lower the tongue until it is about 2 inches lower at the front than at the trailer rear. Lower the rear drop-down stabilizers located behind the trailer wheels by removing the cotter pin from the hitch pin and then removing the hitch pin from the stabilizer. Lower the stabilizer and place the pin back into the hole that allows for the closest contact to the ground. Place the cotter pin back into the hitch pin. Repeat these steps with the rear drop-down stabilizer on the other side of the trailer. Rotate the tongue jack handle to raise the trailer until the stabilizers make contact with the ground. The trailer should now be approximately level with the ground. If you have any questions in regards to hooking and unhooking your tow vehicle from a U-Box trailer, please refer to the guides on the sides of the trailer itself or ask your local U-Haul representative for assistance. You can also contact your local neighborhood U-Haul location.